Wait, wait, wait. Restart, restart. Nope. Okay, good. Are you ready? <laughs> you, gotta, you gotta do the intro thing. Or that's not gonna fucking work. Okay. This is Team 2 Bananas with our all-star Brayden. Alright, so I played Android 17. Um, I thought this was an amazing deck. Um, I actually built this... Um, and how long did it take you to build it? Eh, probably about 20 minutes. I'm not gonna lie to you, it didn't take me very long. Um, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, I like playing this deck because of the fact of um, my 17s and 18s. I do play a lot of 17s and 18s in the deck. Um, I like the fact that I can play them for one less, as well as give them the 5,000 power whenever I'm uh, at four or less life. Plus, the flipping at six is just really great. Amazing. Um, of course, uh, it's what sucks is it's base 10,000 on both sides. Um, only it's 5,000 whenever you're at four or less. So, but um, what's going on in the video? Um, I play two cell absorptions. What do you play that card? I like this card because of the fact that even though it's a 4-drop, um, if you have your 17 and 18, this is basically um, Android's version of Broly to force two cards to be discarded out of the hand. Also can't be bloodlusted. True. You can't bloodlust this bitch. It's fantastic. Fantastic. Um, I played green-blue, so of course I'm going to show some of the blue cards that are in here. Um, I played four Weeks' Coercions because obviously negation is fucking power. Um, and four Boos because I need the draw power. Um, this deck is really good with draw power. Um, so, uh, being able to have that extra card, even if, um, it may come, may come making it the way to turn, um, it's still pretty good to get that extra draw power in. Um, I played two of the Destined Deed Krillins. Why do you uh, play those? I like this card because of the fact that, um, with Android, on um, the reverse side being 17 and 18, as well as playing a lot of 18s, this card plays for free from hand as long as you control an Android 18. It's pretty good. Um, so, and plus it's a blocker, so you just drop it and you just um, keep your card safe. Um, I played two, actually three Human Shield Krillins. Um, I like having a lot of blockers in this deck. Um, because of the fact that my 17s and 18s can be, um, they go up to 20k limit in my 4 or less life. Um, so being able to keep them safe until I have reached that point um, is really good. Um, I played four Senzu Beams. And four objections. Um, of course, oh, I have Mana Ramp being able to... Um, I also played Vegeta as well as Cell um, with Blue to build Mana Ramps. So that way I can play pretty much anything I need to at any given point as well as have leftover mana to protect myself. That's true, that's true. Um, I played four Trunks 10k, shield, or 10K boosters. Uh, of course, this is mandatory in every deck you play. Um, you want to have at least the 10k boost in every deck. Do you know anybody who's played more than 4 of those in a deck? Hey man, when I first started this game, I was playing red and green. I got this. No, I was talking about Marquise. Oh, I don't know who that is. <laughs> you know who that is? You played like 8 of them. Oh, that's true. Actually, no, you played 3 or 4 of each. Yeah, see, so I mean, <laughs> I, I mean, I don't know how that's going to work, but of course, <laughs> of course the 10k is amazing. Uh, being able to draw a card at 4 of life is just awesome. Um, I played 3 of the bundle of uh, Curiosity Sun Gokus for the, just for the draw power. Nice. Um, as for 17 and 18s, I played one of the 5-drop uh, expanding energy android and one of the exterminating energy android. Why only 18. one of each? Most people run two. Um, I preferred at one uh, because of the fact that my main goal was to get out the bro or twin brother, twin sister because of the fact that they can restand themselves. Um, I've seen a lot of combos where you have this out on board, you restand it with 18, and you just keep drawing off your deck and just keep comboing. Um, I want mine to be more control-based versus more of, instead of it trying to be like an OTK. Okay. Um, I played three um, energy power go tanks. Nice, nice. Um, I like this because of the fact of the discard. Uh, I'm probably wrong. I'm probably not reading this card right. Uh, we swing out the leader. Did yeah. They discard a card? Um, whenever whenever you swing out a leader, it has the Broly um, the Broly basic leader effect. Um, forces them to discard a card, and you don't have to deal with the ill effect out of it. Plus, he's 15k at a three drop. It's actually pretty good. Um, I play two Krillin or Tien. And I call it Krillin. I don't really care. They're both bald. Um, I'm yeah, they're both bald. Who cares? Of course, this is basically a staple in every green deck. Um, being able to play it after using it to combo is just a double win for you. Plus, its ability to knock out a card and then um, basically you lose. You may lose two life, but you're getting more resources, which is really awesome. It's a that's a fucking amazing card. Um, for my androids, I played two twenties, two nineteens, three eighteens. Three seventeens. Why not four and four? And two sixteens. Uh, I feel three is good enough, um, especially with twenty being able to search it. Um, Nineteen. A lot of people are telling me I shouldn't play this card. 
Um, I love this card because of the fact that um, turn two, you bring it out at the 10k and you get a free draw. Plus, you have the blockers in the deck, so you can actually easily protect it. So yeah, that's pretty so good. I'm going to make sure this card, like, when it comes to my androids, I make sure they don't die. Um, Plus, that beautiful 16 right there. Yeah, 16 with dual attack, also revenge. But that doesn't have dual attack, it has restand. Yeah, it's a, I mean, it's kind of a dual attack because a lot Better. of people are a lot of people either they're gonna be scared of this and block it, or they're gonna let it go through and I'm just gonna restand and swing again. So I mean, they've really got to wonder, especially with these being able to restand and attack again. Um, they really have to be able to contemplate which one would be the worst threat. And in my opinion, it would definitely be the 17s and 18s. So this is kind of the sleeper card because a lot of people will expect it, but a lot of people aren't gonna block for it. So that is the um, cell, not cell, Android 17 and 18 deck profile. Um, I had a blast playing this deck. I'm going to uh, continue playing it. Um, well, that's a wrap for this video. Uh, please check out our channel and subscribe for more videos. This is Brayden from Team 2 Bananas signing out.